All right. Hey, how you doing? Okay, so a couple things. Uh, first off, you got to keep your wrist straight, bro. Like, I notice you're going... keeps coming off every time you really want all your fingers on the keys the whole time gotta keep that wrist straight see how my thumb is on the <laughs> my thumbs on this a and it stays on that a you know what I mean so that's the first thing I notice you're doing you're twisting. You don't want to twist. You want to keep that wrist as straight as you can. Um, the second thing I notice is yeah, every time you like do something, you take your right hand off of the keyboard. You know, and you're down. do that you kind of want to keep your hand on the keyboard the whole time I mean that's not the biggest deal but I think it kind of helps okay so that's, that's what I kind of noticed with your technique uh, so yeah keep that wrist straight and uh, let me tell you a couple of things to like help you kind of sync up your hands. Like try. Just play the same thing with your right hand as you do with your left hand. Just to get to the, used to the. You know, get used to like like a steady, steady rhythm. Now once you got that smooth, try, try doing like half time with the right hand. So that'd be like uh, one beat with your right hand for every two beats with the left hand. So it'd be like, two different hands and once you got those two down you can do uh, like a double time kind of thing so it'd be two beats with your right hand for every one beat with your left hand which would sound like uh those and get them uh, you know get it nice and smooth and get used to the rhythm then you can start kind of going up and down one thing very important I'm going to show you something called a cross under and a cross over you may or may not know this I haven't noticed you doing it so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna show you real quick so like so we're doing the D so we're playing a D Dorian scale which is just Oops, I messed it up. Let me see, it's hard, it's weird holding the camera, but... It's just all white notes starting on D. So, what you want to do, you play three notes, and you got to bring your thumb under here. So you can keep going. And then when you get back to the thumb going down, then you cross over.
see how that works. You may or may not have known that already. I just hadn't really noticed you doing it. So just thought I would mention that. And uh, yeah, once you, oh my God, I do not have a camera stand. This is literally sitting on a box. Uh, so uh, yeah, so like just get those rhythms down, kind of get the scale down. got the three rhythms down you can sort of just go up and down with it just like so yeah that's what uh, that's what I would do <laughs> All right, man. Hope that helped. Uh, take it easy, bro.